Hello and what is happening everyone? Welcome to my channel. I am of course Blizzard Raptor, this is where I play games for your entertainment and I offer my humble opinion on those games as well. If you are new here, do the YouTube stuff, subscribe, like and comment. And do stick around till the end of the video, there will be links to more of the content on the channel. And let's go finish off Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Is this the end? I don't think so, but we're very, very, very close to it. <clears throat> While we're at the beginning of this episode, I would just like to say thank you to every single person who has watched one of my videos over the last couple of years. I just received my notification that I've hit 9,000 views on the channel, which might not sound like a lot to some people, but to me that is an awful lot, and I cannot thank everybody enough that has tuned in and given me a chance. It's not like the game would take this long to load. Here we go. So, let us fast travel back to... Not too far. To Raventhorpe. And see how Sigurd's feeling after being a captive of Bulky the Mad for too long, to be perfectly honest. God knows what she's done to him. She's obviously tortured him for a while. We know that. Wonder how broken he is. This is taking an inordinately long time. I have clicked on the, the PS5 version, yeah? I'm wondering if I've maybe clicked on the PS4 version by mistake. So loading time shouldn't be this long. You know what, I have clicked on the PS4 version then. No worries. No, it's the PS5. So there's the PS4 version there. Yeah. That's just taken an inordinately long time to load. I'm not used to that, I'm used to it just being really quick. I mean, it's a PS5 with an SSD for goodness sake. Let's go see what Sigurd has to say. Wonder if he'll be pissed off that I killed Dag. Probably. Sigurd Jarl, back where you belong. Oh, I missed you, my brother. Yeah, you missed me. Yeah. Once or twice a year. What? It took you time to find me. Was it for this? To enjoy your time on my throne? I did only what you asked of me. And you slew all those who questioned you. That is not what happened. Ranvi, Ranvi will tell you. Oh yeah, we'll see. My dear wife. Brought to me as a gift by her clan to pacify my ambition. Yes, I'm sure she will be the one to tell me the truth. What did that witch, Fulke, do to you? You cannot even begin to imagine the things I've seen. What I've learned. Born of gods is who I am. A lord of war. A Roman Mars. I know who I am. I know my destiny. And you will not hinder me! Forgive me. I am faint. I'm tired of the day and all that has passed. I need air.
Oh. He's been this way since his return. Could you speak with him? Settle his mind? I can try. Mm. Stand with cheer, one and all. Basem. Day of celebration. Okay. Our Jarl is with us. Basem, will you not join us? In time, I may celebrate, but tonight is a melancholy mood. I would rather sit here quietly, alone, with my thoughts. I understand. Do not let Sigurd's present mood upset you. He spoke warmly of you as we sailed here. I believe he still trusts you more deeply than he can express. We trust each other. That is clear. Enjoy the feast, Eivor. Oh, spinning your webs. Where is Sigurd gone? Survey the area soonin. I thought he would be out by the seer, but he's not. He seems to just be randomly wandering. I half expected him to be raging. I mean, Basim says he spoke warmly, he was obviously glad, but then he's got back and someone's told him that I've killed Dag. And he obviously thinks... I mean, Filky's maybe tortured him and told him, like, what, basically said that I was a traitor, and the fact that I've killed Dag helps that perception. But maybe he's just, maybe he's just got split personality. Soon in, yeah, there we go. What is he at? A standing stone or something? Yeah. Looks like they are some kind of carved stone or something. In the cemetery, his mood is dark. Oh, there is you are, brother. Here to see Dag. That's Dag's grave. What are you doing here? I was looking for you. Sigurd. Dark died defending my honor? So he claimed. But he was a fool. My honor needs no defense. It is stone solid. Unblemished. I offered him a way out, but... Shh. Say nothing more of the past. It is gone. There is a rift as deep as death between then and now. I was tested, Eivor, in a crucible of blood and fire. And in my agony, I was reborn. You may think me less than I was, but this is not so. I am greater than before. My mind is a wellspring of prophecies, visions that tell me who I truly am. And for all that, I am grateful for my suffering. Sigurd, I want to understand. But all this, all you say makes little sense. Basim saw these things in me. Fulke, too. Despite her cruelty, she spoke the truth. I am more than the man I was. More than this hobbling stick that stands before you. You must look harder, Eivor. Deeper. See for yourself what they found in me. Do you see it? My greater self. I... I don't know what that means. Look! This is the face of a god. I see only my brother and my truest friend. Return to where he is loved and cherished. Where he's meant to be. You are kind. But your eyes are clouded by the past. A place I can no longer see. I fear our paths diverged long ago. I wish to be alone. Return to my feast and drink for me. Celebrate the days to come in my name. <clears throat> <sighs> well.
Well, that's not the reunion that we were all hoping for. I mean, it's not like he's going to be fighting his own battles, is it? Unless he learns to swing a sword left-handed. Looks like something is happening near Volker's hut. Perhaps I should take a look. Now it seems the wind calls me back to Ranvi. Best tell her the good news. Haha, <laughs> what good news? Right, quests. That's us being pushed on to a distorted dream. Reporting on Sussex. Good to see you, darling. What happened yesterday? You and Sigurd disappeared during the feast. And when he returned, he went straight to our room without a word. We talked for a time. I asked many questions, but got few answers. I wish I could say more. Do you think Sigurd knows? About us? I don't think so. He would have said something. Sigurd wants to blame me for every mishap that has befallen him, but gives me no credit for his rescue. I don't understand. Yet he does speak with you. With me, he has gone totally silent. So, what now? This is for Sussex. We burned it to the ground to save one man. Yet he's barely the man we were searching for. Quite so. Well... Where is... Why is it saying... Oh. Yeah, these are all the... DLCs. Because I've got the power levels to do these now. What do I do? <laughs> I mean... Don't know when I got some of these. I genuinely haven't played any more of this since the last episode that went up. So I am a little confused as to why I've got certain things. Figure it out together, I suppose. As for quests, do we just keep forging alliances? Must. It's the only thing I can do. I want to see the alliance map. So there's only two places left. Urivishir, I think that is. Uh, which will eventually be Yorkshire. Because that's Jorvik, which we've completed, but this is the wider territory now. And Gloucestershire. Uh, does it make any difference? What awaits in Jorvikshire? Halfton Ragnarsson, conqueror of the north, sends his greeting. He wishes to meet with Eivor Wolfkist personally. Halfton Jarl. I have heard that man's name so often. I feel as though I know him already. He is currently entangled in a war with the Picts of the Northern Hills. I suspect he wants your counsel, or your axe. If you are keen to meet him, he asks that you join him at his war camp. I have the location here. I'll pledge to your Viksha. I'll go at once. With caution, Eivor. Yorvikshire is currently at war with the Picts, a proud clan that lives just beyond the Roman Wall. There doesn't seem to be anything else for me to do as far as my brother's concerned, so... Might as well go do the war in the north. Is 
This isn't a part of your big shed, is it? Must be. Uh, I was hoping for an easy fast travel, but I forget that I haven't unlocked all all the viewpoints in the game. I'm basically just gonna run across the run across the river. Well, swim across the river and travel there on my horse. What is up with these load times? Or I will boat <laughs> across to the uh, other side and then I'll fast travel. Not fast travel, I'll shout my horse. There we go. Let's go. Those load times are really annoying me, though. Yeah. Half Dan Jarl, I'm sure, was the guy in... The, the steward that was in Norwich was looking for me to get someone on the throne for Halfdan Jarl. I think I've heard of his name before as well. He must be the most powerful Jarl in the north of England. Sorry, the, the buttons are... <laughs> My muscle memory is really, really good, but I did play quite a lot of that Stellar Blade demo, which, you know, is only natural because it's a fantastic game. And because I've played Signs of battle. so much of that, my muscle memory is like programmed to the Stellar Blade rather than the the Assassin's Creed Valhalla controls. I will get it back, don't worry. It just takes me a... Hard fought on both sides. Takes me about an hour. Is there a ladder in here? Yeah, there is. I want to hit the viewpoint while I'm here. Ladder in here as well? Yeah, there is. Trigve. I've heard his name as well.
get rid of them while I can. Is up here that I want to go. Is there a way to take my horse up? Was there another path? Is there not a bridge? No. Right, okay. Up we go then. In fact, you know what else it might be with the controls as well? I've been playing a lot of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. And I noticed that I'm hitting R2 quite a lot to run, which is default control in that game. Thor lends me climb into the hills. The battle did indeed climb into the hills by the looks of things. Picked. Talk to here and get every man's name. We leave none behind. Well met, Abel Ravenfren. Now there's a face I've seen before. Fair of it. We met in Jorvik, the Yuletide feast. The Yuletide massacre. I remember. What brings you here? Halfdan Jarl. He summoned me. Is he near? He was, but the Picts hit us hard. We were separated. Fresh attack from the hills. Watch your backs! Picts. They won't be happy to see the likes of me. No, they will not, indeed. Odin! In for the kill! <laughs> Oh, helm! There more archers? I think there is, isn't there? Yeah, there is. Bye. 
die. Lead the way. Oh, okay. I'll live. If we die today, tonight we drink with Odin. Either way, we claim victory. Somebody threw him his hammer back so he looked like Thor. That was brilliant. That was so well done. I like that. You owe me your life, old friend. Once again. Halfdan Regnason, we meet in the Forge of Battle. Surely a good sign. I don't know you. One of Faroid's new dogs? I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. Eivor, yes. Down in Mercia. Kingmaker with my brothers Ivar and Uba and Finir in East Anglia. From the tales I hear, I feared you might be taller. That's not a fear you feel often, I imagine. So you answered my summons. <laughs> The timing is poor, as you can see. Too many here are spent, battle sore. Thirsty. Faravid, have your men build field pyres for the dead. At once, my yard. Not here, not now. Oh. Then to Donnacaster for a victory feast! He thinks there's a uh, traitor. The oldest son of Ragnar Lothbrook, so he says. What do you make of him? A heroic display. He makes a powerful first impression. Just the way he likes it. Welcome to Jorvikshire, friend. Well met, Faravit. I was hoping your Jarl would be as welcoming, but I suppose I must earn his trust. Is that why you've come here? To earn Hafton's trust? To find a seat at his table? I have my own table. What I want is a bond of friendship between the new lords of England. Among whom you count yourself, I suppose. It is an ally I seek, not a master. Well, there is but one lord of Northumbria. Hmm. There'll be no jumping down this, I take it, but I can climb down. So we'll do that and then head to the Doncaster, which is where he told me to go. Half decent football team in Doncaster, I believe. Here we ride. So the plan for the next couple of episodes then guys will be to try and try and catch up. Do the bits that we might have been able to do earlier. Do half dance, do Hamptonshire the and Roman then giants outdid themselves with this fortress. 
uh, yeah, and then see what happens with Sigurd's storyline. Like I say, I'm, all, I'm well further in the game than I've ever been before. So I do not know. I, I don't know what I'm doing. Well, I do know what I'm doing. I know how to play the game. I just I don't know any more about the story than you guys do at this point in time. So. Yeah, I feel like I've been here before. Aid me. Yeah, he's definitely up here, isn't he? Wait a minute, where was... That was a way up here in Northam... Ah, wait a minute, yeah, no. This might be... It feels like the fort that I did in one of the previous episodes when I helped my friends become... Yeah, my friend become Yarrow again. I promise. But Halfton needs me now. Ah. Out. Down. Really? As Thor has swallowed the oceans, I can lift many horns and drain them, too. A bold claim! I'll drink to that! I didn't mean to start this. Gonna lose. Yep. Didn't mean to start that anyway, so I'm not that fussed about that. But now I'm wasted. And I'm still trying to find this half done dude. Here, Dane. Try your look at throwing bones. Where is... Surely that's it there, no? Need your eye. See, I'd have thought here. the very top. Ugh. Why would you do that? Why am I stuck? There we go.
So it's basically all the way up as high as we can go. Through here, up here, to the left. Uh, we need to go up again. I can't get any... Oh yeah, I can. I was going to say I can't get any higher, but I can. Wait, hang on a minute. Now you're just taking the mic. I've come all the way up here because the game said this is where he was. Stretch your wings, Sunan. Where is he? Well, this is his throne room. But Faravir is the one out there fighting. Excuse me. No sooner. That is the plan. Yet my people suffer day by day. Your people. Do you rule a shadow kingdom under my nose? Our people suffer from these brutal winter raids. This war must end. That is my first concern. The time to strike is... is... when I say we strike. Aftan's hammer protects this land. Tell my people that. King Aesir. As you wish, my lord. Who is this? Come closer. Haftan Regnason. My sword arm answers your call. Thank you for your tribute, Eivor Wolfkist. Your battles and deeds are well known to me. And you are the hero of Yorick. So sing my scalds. Not just any hero. Eivor brought order to the city when King Rishier could not. They say you rooted out a gang of thieves and traitors. Not alone. But I led the charge. You gifted my silver to the calls and chills of Yorick. To men and women who needed it most. A foolish choice. The coin never left King Rishier's treasury. I try never to regret the decisions I make in a time of war. Agreed. To second guess ourselves would only stall the victory. Of course it would. I don't regret sending Faravid to lead our strike against the pits, in spite of Eivor winning the day. Eivor and I held them half the long, so you could sweep in, stab a few cold corpses, and claim a glorious victory. Oh. <laughs> Old friend, your jests hit like Odin's spear, always on the mark. I would not be here without your hammer, Gradyard. Please accept this, your share of the loot we want today. A thing of beauty. Hmm. Frankish, I believe. What do you think, Eivor? A fine piece of work, fit for the lips of a king. Or a man who makes kings. There's wisdom in this one, Faravid. By your leave, Lord, I must return to my forward camp. It's a long, cold ride. Two-faced smirk in glory, Hound. My lord. In your summons, you said... Shh. Not here. Not now. Dance. Sing. Fill yourself with air. The maiden atop this tower of stone. There I will weave a tale of friendship and treachery. Oh! The tale is old as the world. Paravid... Paravid might have been in on what was happening in Yorick. Are you a nun? I thought nuns dressed like geese. 
Nothing of the sort. I am Moira of Weka, Hafton's herbalist. He is an ill man, and I do what I can to give succor and hope. I saw him fight. He was in fine health then. Thanks in part to my soothing tonics. Would you pardon me? Soothing tonics, my backside. Oh, sorry. Whoops. Well, we've already done the drinking. Let's just go up and meet him. I've done a bit of drinking. Hopefully that'll be enough if if I do need to do something to push the quest forward. Dogs do not beg for silver. Dogs do not yearn to be yards. But I am a wolf. No, a wolf king. It's up here he wanted to meet, wasn't it? Do I have to do, I have to do the feast activities? Because that's bang out order if I do, because I really don't want to play games. Ah, Eivor. Come, let me show you a wonder. Conquered this, he and I, together. You've earned great fame, won many battles across England. But not alone, no, no. Bjorn Ironside, fearless Uber, Eva the Boneless, Sacred Snake and I, great warriors all, my brothers. Gold is good and battle better, but glory never dies. Forever lives in the Hall of Heroes, high on Valor's steed. Together we have conquered. Together with my friends, my clan. Faravid, above all others. One sword is not an army, Eva. Even a hero needs loyal friends. I have never lost sight of that. Never. Have you room for one more among those you call friend? What does friendship mean to you, Eivor? Friendship goes beyond words. It is a solemn bond, a chain unbroken. Spoken like the Fowler, it is indeed a kind of magic. You wriggle like an eel in a basket, Hafton. What has called you? Friendship can also spoil, like rotten meat. After all these years, he dares to bite my hand. Faravit, he seems a good and loyal man. Seems, yes. As a bright sky in winter seems warm. But rumors fly of little men plotting treason in the dark. Have you proof of his treachery? Not yet. That is where you enter my saga. Prove this for me. Discover if Faravid has been disloyal. Then we shall talk of oaths. Start me somewhere. Give me something to go on. You see this? From a sea unicorn. I filter my mead and wine with it. I've heard of such beasts. They swim below the ice, beyond the world's edge. And their horns protect against poison. You believe Faravid wants to poison you? I fear he has tried. Countless times. And failed them all. You don't believe me, but I know the man. His gifts of wine, his easy smile, his envy, his plots. 
Learn the truth. Dig up... <coughs> ...unearth his treason. Why trust me with such a task? Jorvik, you stopped the ill deeds of Auden and his swarm of rats. You can do the same here. Like a good sword, Anna has two edges. I'll help you. Faravid has left the feast already, heading for his camp upriver. Join his warband, and behind his back, dig. And if I find nothing, if he's a good and loyal man. Even better, even better. Fair enough. I will find what I find, then return, my friend. Don't let Faravid fool you. He is hiding something. Of course he is. Everybody's hiding something. Assassins have the coolest ways of getting around. Oh, you're a fancy one. Sitting up in Hafton's tower. So we need to find his camp. Which means heading this way. Ah, there's a bridge just here though. Perfect. Yeah. Okie doke. What are we at? 47 minutes? Ah, we've got time. I like these to be about an hour long, so... It's just an accident that I've gone for grit. Oh! We can go to the quest objective. Excellent! So we've met Faravid once already, and he actually helped me keep Rishiga on the throne, but I wonder if that was the Ancients' plot. wonder if maybe they were looking to keep Rishiga on the throne because he's one of them. This is all speculation, of course, but eh. I don't think we're that far away from this either. 700 meter right. It does feel like we're close to the end of this though. With just a couple of territories to do And these don't take long. Ahead. Yeah, I had a feeling it was off this path. That must be Ferovitz's camp ahead. Cold and dirty. Must be the place. Throw yourself in, Gunungagap, you bastard! I am not a dog! Yet here you are, barking again. Because we beg for scraps from Haftan's table, like dogs. Faravid! Ah, Eivor, my friend. Is Donacaster hospitality to your liking? I would be careful calling this one friend, Faravid. The crow who comes flapping when Haftan gives a whistle. Haftan and I spoke, and what of it? 
This is our fight, our chance for glory. Fly on home, crow. Lend me a knife, Ferevit. This whelp needs scalding. Ofer, piss off. Small men always talk big. So, was Hafton generous? Did you get what you came for? If I help with your fight against the Picts, Hafton will consider me a friend. So point the way, Ferevit. The Picts raided that monastery. Plundered its silver and gold. The Saxons built more churches and barns and filled them with herds of monks. Yes, monasteries make tempting targets. And not just for us. We tracked Pictish raiders heading north. Gold is fine, but victories are treasure. What's your plan? To open their bellies with my knife. I'm ready to fight. Let's put them in the ground. Halfdan didn't send you north to fight a skirmish we could win with half our numbers. Why are you here, Eivor? To help you battle the Picts, nothing more. He knows my reputation, and he knows what advantage I bring. You question my word. You never gave it. Then I give you my word, Ferevit. I'm here to fight pigs. To arms, dogs! Let's roast some pigs! <laughs> Watch for ambushes. Should have stayed in Doracastre. More meat, fewer pigs. There's no glory in guard duty. Move out! The pigs are just ahead. Lead the way, and we'll watch your back. Masters of guile and ambush. Have a care. That one's going to annoy me because they're just outside my range. And they're away around the corner for me. Let's work together. All right, okay. Jesus. And the picks were sneaky sons of bitches, by the way. I'm only doing that to check for that, exactly that.
Thank Thor we made it. That was good war work, all. This cave is a passage. The pigs are using it to cross the mountain. A gift for us. You track them through the cave. We'll circle around back and snare any who try to slip away. I've been here before. Whoops, missed. Ah, whoa. Yeah, I've been here before. Half Dan's cave was. Uh, is it Half Dan's cave? It was got no, the Wiccan cave. This is where I had to come to get the one of the treasures, and I've done that now, so that won't be a distraction. Yeah, it was just in the middle there, to be fair. And some of this you can't climb. I think I have to climb the tree. Yeah. Soon and then we'll all eat like kings. Heed my words. Wrong side of the wall. My feast buffs about to run it. The pigs spoke of Stenweyer, their camp. That's to the north. Their chief may be there. Stop them before they reach Stenweyer. They spotted us. Run forward. Faster. Faster. Ulf. Ulf. Glory for Ulf. Damn it. I see him. This guy's miles away. Can't I? Uh... Right, let's see out on a horse. Picked raiders. They got away. Picked raiders south of the wall. Don't like it. Let us regroup at Stenway. We need to plan our next move. Look for Stenway then. Eh, hey, there we go. And there is a way across the river as well. Shh. Although, again, forgetting, of course, that my horse can swim.
The Picts don't raid often during winter. The Picts will be on guard. Have a care. Excuse me? The Hornets have led us to their nest. More than a chief up there. Looks like the forward camp of an army. But would the Picts dare attack in winter? Hafton thinks not. And the Picts may use that to their advantage. Let's find out. So the camp's on alert. Why would the Picts make war in winter? They must have a reason. Something to gain. Let's do this the sensible way. Since the camp is alerted, since they're expecting me. Say sleek it there. Did they? Huh? That's cool. A Scots one for sneaky. Might as well help myself. While I'm here. To hunt down the big with his head. You get come on, lad. No time for sleeping on the job. Done for now. Up that way next. Oh, there's a this is a locked door. Where's the key? What do you see soon?
Is that ha <laughs> ha brilliant? How do I get in then? Out of luck, needy girl. So that's a slide down. And you know what? Nick the tungsten ingot. No escape. Just the rest. Zas. Have we done? Oh, I've got the key. Ha! <laughs> Come on then. Come and have a look, see if anybody's here. Yeah, archery's overpowered. Makes this game far, far too easy. A uh, key. There was a key here, I think, but... Yeah. Go grab this armor quickly. I'm here, I might as well. Come on, give me the raven. Be my eyes soon. I don't think I think I must have got it. Can't help but notice what's his face isn't here. Helping me. There's the chief. Now to strike him down. On the wrong side of the giant's wall, friend. Have you come to make war in winter? <laughs> Fool! He might have talked. We got what we came for. Is that more Frankish wine? I'll take a few casks. And that silver there. Ofer, that's Hafton's share. Eivor, just in time to divide the spoils. Take some meat, if you like. The pigs are at Magnus. This map spells it out. Ah, the wolf kissed is a reader. That's Dark Seder I'll never mess with. 
Worry about the pits later. Now's the time for treasure and spoils. You earn it. It should be ours. We did the work. All of it. And nothing for half done. Warming his cock in a Saxon castle. Open that cask and we'll have a taste. We'll celebrate together. Sorry, friend, but that's Hafton's take. You understand. He won't notice one missing cask. So unless there's something wrong with it, let's have a taste. There's nothing wrong with it, friend. If you insist, we'll all drink some stinking wine. Ooh. A little sour, but not bad. I've always preferred ale myself, or spiced mead. What I won't drink is one of Moira's herbal brews. She claims they're a tonic, but there's no telling what she hides in those drinks. Moira. I met her at the feast. She's a herbalist from the north, always skulking in the shadows of Hafton's throne. It's a big throne. Don't you all skulk around it from time to time? Why all these doubts, Eivor? You're a warrior, not a rumor monger. Doubt is too strong a word. But there is a feeling of mistrust among you. I want this alliance to be ironclad. Then let me change your mind. I've got a plan to win this war for good before the winter sets in. Magnus is a strong fort, but we'd be attacking from the south. With speed, we'll catch them off guard. With Hafton's blessing, I'd fight beside you anywhere. Name the time and place. No, Hafton is done fighting for the winter. He thinks it too great a risk, but I say we can win this war before the next snow. If we tell him of this plan, he'll refuse, but if we succeed, you and I together, he'll sing our praises all the louder. There are no secrets in this world or the next. The Old Father sees everything. We need not fear Odin's eye, only Hafton's wrath. I must return to Donacaster for a time. But I will join you for this battle. Deliver this goblet to my Jarl. He has a fondness for them. And tell him his share of the spoils is coming. When you're ready, find me near Jorvik at a place called the Waltz. Hafton shares shrinks after each victory. Like his cock, eh? I don't like golf. But that Moira is suspicious. I've seen too many things. Like too many... Sort of... What would you call them? Films, movies, whatever kind of media. Where... There's like a, a herbalist, quote unquote, who's poisoning somebody. And no one else can tell because no one else knows... Like the herbalist trade. If he's para if he's developing paranoia, I think he's being um I think he's being worked on by that Moira. I think she's she is poisoning him, but I think she's giving him stuff to make him delirious. But anyway, this episode's long enough. We are gonna call it there. We'll find out what Halfband sent to it in the next episode. Once again, thank you everyone for your views. Please, can I encourage you to subscribe? To help you with that, on screen in a moment you will see a button in the middle of the screen. It looks like the logo for my channel. If you click that, it will add your subscription to the channel. You will see on the right hand side a playlist for the channel. And on the left hand side of the screen you will see a recommended video. 
and in the top right hand corner you should see the link to a curated video. All of that content there for you guys, there's plenty of videos, I think I've got upwards of 400 on here now. So there's plenty for you guys to watch and I will see you for more Assassin's Creed Valhalla real soon. Thank you and bye for now. Yeah.